Welcome back to another grammar video where we show you how to improve your essays. Today we're looking at sentence types and clauses. Every sentence is made up of a combination of clauses and there are two types of clauses, independent and dependent. An independent clause is a clause that makes sense without any other information surrounding it, whereas a dependent clause is the addition of detail or information onto the independent clause. So, how do we use these clauses to form sentences? The first sentence we will look at is a simple sentence. This is made up of a singular independent clause. A simple sentence may look like Annie turned on a film or the cat meowed. These sentences are not split up into different sections by the use of commas or multiple clauses. The next type of sentence is a complex sentence. These are made up by combining one independent clause with one or more dependent clauses. This may look like Joe cried because the film upset him. By using the connective because, we can see that this sentence has two parts. The first part, Joe cried, is the independent clause and then the dependent clause, because the film upset him, adds detail to this sentence and informs the reader of why Joe was crying. Then we have compound sentences. This sentence type is made up of two or more independent clauses. This means that each part of the sentence needs to make sense on its own. This could appear as Joe cried and Annie laughed, or the cat had a black tail and the dog had a brown tail. Using the connective AND shows that these are separate pieces of information rather than the BECAUSE we used in the complex sentence to add detail. The last sentence type is a complex compound sentence. These types of sentences include two or more independent clauses as well as one or more dependent clause. As an example, this could show up as Joe cried because the film was sad and Annie laughed. Here we can see the first independent clause, Joe cried, followed by the dependent clause, because the film was sad, and then ends with the second independent clause, Annie laughed. Using a variety of these sentences within your essay will help not only the detail you can include, but also the readability and level of interest you can invoke from readers. We hope this video has helped you feel more confident in writing your own essay. See you next time!